So what do you have there? Excuse me. This right here is my Hulk. Um, oh, that's awesome. My wife got it for me when I graduated from law school, so I'm, gonna look, I'm a lawyer now. Oh, cool. So, yeah. Congrats. Um, yeah. <laughs> Which, well, actually, I retired Army, so... Um, you ever heard of the Rangers? Yeah. yeah. The Rangers is equivalent to the SEALs for the Army. You got it. Uh, I think I got like 12 or 13 watches out this weekend. Oh, really? But these are the ones that we had in stock. How many of them do we already have in here? Uh, one, two, three, four, and then I gotta pull the rest from stock. Sold. 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 Uh, three people already picked up their watches over the weekend. I just came in and opened. Oh yeah, you came on Saturday, didn't you? Yes. Yeah. Sold. He owes me an R8. Do what? Oh yeah. I made a bet with him that he couldn't sell 10 watches on his trip down and back to Houston. And if he did, I was going to give him the R8 for the weekend. So we're going to go through this. I'm going to tally them all up and make sure. As long as we get paid for them all, yeah. you get the R8 this weekend. He made a bet. And I, I said call that. my insurance company. <laughs> oh, here's another one. Tell him if you see a R8 on YouTube racing a McLaren, it's not me. Sold. Okay. If I see them, what? I said, uh, tell them if you see an R8 on YouTube racing a red McLaren, it's not me. Okay. All right. <laughs> as soon as I get the keys, I'm hitting my boy up and say, let's go. We're, we're doing a we're doing a 20 20 day. It's gonna be a colorful race. Yeah, it is. Oh yeah. <laughs> Who's got the red McLaren? Uh, my. Uh, you didn't meet my customer that came in last week, right? He bought the Scott and the Cartier. Oh, Santos. yeah, yeah. His thing was outside. Yeah, 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 yeah. Is it a 600? No, it's or? a 5, 520. Okay. Wade Foreman's watch was already shipped, so I sold that one actually. Did you trade too. something with that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. He traded oh, okay. the white Smurf that we got. Okay. What about or the blue sky? The blue sky is. Do you know the amount? Um, he traded it. Jenny, right here. Twenty-two-five. Yep. Uh, right. He traded something for that too. Nope, nope. He just paid. Okay. He just paid. So that was so good. Uh, the white sky. White sky. Gotta look at the name. I forgot. This week we are going for two million in sales. By the way, these don't oh, okay. count. They do count. Well, these I don't know. count. <laughs> Starting today. <laughs> uh, <laughs> if these all right. So this was two million, then I take back the R8. Uh, yeah. That would make sense unless there's a. No, you know that. what? That was Jin Lee. Sorry. Oh, it, they're both the same exact number. I apologize. Uh, he traded in the Cartier Santos brand new. It's, it's got that new, that new crazy doll. It's on hold. It's on hold. Oh, I know. It's that, yeah, it's already on hold. It's a Torbjorn uh, right Royal Oak. Nope, that's Melvin Malone. That's my yeah, Batman that's going on today. That? Actually, yeah, I sold that too. The new reference? Yeah. Okay. The, huh? That's yeah. your guy? Yep. Do we have that in stock? Ah, uh, it's already gone. Yeah, that's um, mine. That's a... Um, that's the GMT that I sold. He picked that up Saturday. Trade deal? Uh, yes. Okay. He traded in for, oh, um, oh, he traded yeah, out, like say, blue 41 OP. It's, uh, oh, that's where that's at. Oh, I saw that. Yeah, Did yeah. you do that in inventory? Yeah. The blue OP that was sitting on the... And then that Tudor. Tudor, which is uh, uh, Alfred. Uh, it's like a black and... I can pay 75 for a 263.1 on a strap or no? Uh, uh, OR? Yeah, blue. Blue? Blue. Yeah. Yeah. We'll right? Convert it. The newer used. Yeah. Oh, pre owned? What year? Give me specs because I might commit. Yeah. Okay. Come on. Hey, look at this. Is that factory? No. If that were factory, it'd be so expensive. I mean, what, wow. half a million or more? Uh, yeah, easy. Did you see the first um, <clears throat> stainless steel green dial uh, paddock vessel for 500000 $22,000 watch? 34. <laughs> I think it's 34 retail. Is it 34 yeah. retail? Okay. I think. Oh, sorry. I'm thinking of the 15 too. That's yeah. sold? Yeah. Yeah. Is that paid for? No, he's going to pay for it. I there was like three that. tutors, actually. So three it was tutors. that, a blue Pelagos, and a black Pelagos. Mark, yeah. Put, would so, you put sticky notes on all these? Uh, and then we, we just got to figure out that one, but that one, that one should have been. It's boxing papers, but <laughs> we got it several years ago um, while we were in Vegas. Okay, son, you ready? So talk to me. So you got, do you see, what do you 
He studies this stuff. Uh, okay, <laughs> let me see this. These are. Okay. Or, um, okay. Yeah. What's that one specifically called again? No. Uh, Plat oh, that's platinum. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> platinum. Over here. Okay. <laughs> Full disclosure, I brought a. That one has a s slide right here. You'll see where I think she nicked it, but you'll see it here. Oh, yeah, I see it. So, what do you have there? Excuse me. This right here is my Hulk. Um, oh, that's awesome. My wife got it for me when I graduated from law school, so I'm a, I'm a lawyer now. Oh, cool. so Yeah. Good congrats. Um, yeah. <laughs> Which, well, actually, I retired Army, so um, you ever heard of the Rangers? Yeah. yeah. The Rangers is equivalent to the SEALs for the Army. You got it. I served myself. Yeah. So, did you do, oh, uh, did you go to, is it Georgia? Yeah, Fort Benny, Georgia. Yeah. Uh, um, I'm an old infantry officer, so it's hard. But I did that airborne school, jump master school, all that. Yeah. Thank you for your service, man. No, oh, no worries. So, what were you looking to do? Consign or sell? Um, my wife wants to consign that one for okay. sure. Cool. Um, or sell it or whatever. Okay. Um, she's easy on that. She's she's good. She's more of the motorcyclist. Oh, she likes the Ducati. Oh, yeah. She would have loved last night. <laughs> <laughs> I'm terrified of the motorcycle. But you'll jump out of a plane. Yeah. I blew stuff up for a living and now I'm terrified of the motorcycle. <laughs> um, so we can consign this for like anywhere from four to 4500 that's cool. Um, and we just have a minimum fee of 500 bucks. We gotta do it to Perfect. Perfect. So. We'll do it. When she cool. gets here, I want her to see it. So oh, okay. She's on her way. Yeah, okay, she's cool. On her way. Yeah, yeah. Okay, awesome. I love that dial. What dial? Yeah, it's cool. Buy it for your lady. Actually, yeah. Right? I've seen probably all of y'all videos probably about a thousand times. Wow. So I understand them all. Um, and I support everything y'all have done. Okay. Appreciate it. Thank you. And I get it. I totally get it. Um, where would you go from here? Like, I have a Daytona. My Grail watch is the is the Plutona. That's that's my that's my puppy right there. What all do you have? Well, just these two. Over the years, I've had day dates. I've had subs. I had oysters. Never anything at, at that level. Um, so I'm trying to figure out. Yes, I love it. I know what I have here. Um, nothing like these these things. <laughs> um, that's just echelons above reality. But this one's actually not that bad though. Like if you want to step in an AP game, the I've dual never time. been an AP guy. <laughs> okay. Never been an AP guy. You have the, the Rolls White was Daytona, and then what else? The Hulk. And the Hulk. Like if you already have two pieces and you know what your end state is. You're trying to find the betweener. Up to that, you know, or do you do you step well, in there and see it in a year or two, do you, or, or eight months? Do you so, do you ever see yourself as a one watch guy? I'm a couple watch. I like to change. So if you okay, so uh, with that being said, I would you know, kind of baby step up towards it. Okay. So because um, because like, you know when you do eventually get the watch, the appreciation once you have it is so much greater than just quickly satisfying it you know as quick as you can. Yeah, man. You know what I mean? Like, that's how I am. Like, when I, if I get to a watch too fast that I've always wanted, then I actually lose the appreciation. So you're kind of a Daytona guy. I'm a Daytona guy. I mean, I like, I like the Smurf. My daughter loves the Smurf. That's this is a great yeah. stepping stone to a, a grail piece like that, uh, Platinum. Oh, that's gorgeous. Yes. And, then, and those are just going up. Would you do this or would you do the green dial? I would go with that. You would? Yeah. yeah. Okay. But I like rose over yellow. Same. Here. Yeah. She actually just retired from the army about three weeks ago. Oh wow! Oh, nice. Congratulations. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Well, thank you guys for serving our country. Thank you. They're gonna consign nice your watch. I don't see both you all in person since I get spammed a lot. Oh. Spammed. <laughs> 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 Put a lot of work into that. You know it's what? You know do. it's working. You do. And your <laughs> He's got his eye on something new. Yeah. Yes! <laughs> you know, he was uh, watching one of your shows, I don't know which one it was, and you said, like, you, it's hard to get a wife to, convince a wife to spend money on a watch that oh, people pay for a college. 
creation. Right. Mm-hmm. They're so right. I mean, he's still working on that. Right. <laughs> I'm not convinced. He's convinced. As long as you buy the one, now here's here's where I would argue against that. Is as long as you're buying, you're putting the money. Say you're now. I'm. I hope it doesn't get misconstrued the wrong way. I would never say take money out of a college fund to put into a watch, mm-hmm. but I would put money into a watch that I can appreciate. And then with the end goal being, whenever I sell this watch, this money is going to be meant for my kid's it's college. Totally, but I put it in a watch that I know will go up in value. Yes, it's about that, the, the investment piece of it. And right. it's just getting to the initial investment. Mm-hmm. It, that, sure. That's where my hang up is. You know, I, his toys are the Rolexes, mine are the cars. So. There you go. So if, if they discontinue that. I think they'll do similar to what they've done to the Pepsi, the Batman. They'll just, sh- you know, new movement, maybe change a few things. Now, I was talking with a collector one time, completely discontinuing the Platinum Daytona, I don't think will ever happen because if you think of one, popularity, two, not even the popularity, I think the biggest reason is if you think, um, I believe it's Muslim cultures. Yeah, like they, yeah they can't. They can't wear gold. Yeah, yeah. So, but they, but they, but they will precious metals. So they'll keep platinum around for that very reason. When that gets discontinued, I see that being easily a 250, 260 watch. The regular platinum, I see about 175, 180. And we don't have a regular platinum, but on the regular platinum, the chapter rings and the chronos are brown. So it has more yeah, going yeah, on. Three, yeah. I like this one simply because of how simple the dial looks. Yeah. You don't really get lost in it. Sometimes yeah. I had an, I had an older model Daytona um, aluminum bezel, not aluminum, but well, steel, steel, steel bezel, steel, yeah. and uh, black face, and I could not tell the time. She left. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> you two would do. You will go from here and the whole to um, to the uh, rose gold, for rose sure. gold, and then from rose gold up to platinum. Yeah. Okay. All right. Now, is it? Would you be trading those two in to get it, or would yeah, you just be buying them? I think I'm about doing that. So that, you're what, close to it. On, you're close to that. Yeah, you're pretty that much right there. That goes for 65. There. What year's your white Daytona? 16, 17. Uh, you're looking at this. Mm-hmm. She's like 16 or 17. What year is the Hulk? Uh, 19. 8, 19. So if you saw a couple years. Yeah, yeah, that's not Okay, so it's just, it's just assume 18, 19. 75 minus. What do you want to sell yours for? 65. You're looking at that, don't you? That's, that's how far you are from the Rose Gold. Yeah, it's not bad at all. And that, that uh, the Baguette Daytona, that's a 20. It's a new card, right? I believe it's a new card. Yeah. No, it's 2021. I just got that from the AD this year. Got you. That one's mine. Gosh. Yeah, because you had two. You sold one. I had to make room for this. How do you like that? It's okay. I'm selling my Daytona. Yeah. yeah. I, uh, I actually sold, or am selling, five of my watches. How does it feel on the Oh, it's amazing. That, that watch, honestly, that watch has ruined okay. me. Please. That watch has ruined me because since... Since I, it's three and a half years ago, since I've owned more than two watches at one time, I've never worn one watch longer than a week. I've not taken that one off. I've worn that for two and a half weeks straight. Yeah. Little hairlines, like I'm okay with. Um, I haven't scratched this bezel yet. Um, and the Daytonas are ceramic. Yes. Now the gold bezels, they will get, you have to be careful wiping them with like your shirt or doing this because the hairlines, it'll drive you crazy. And that's the only downside to precious metal Daytonas is that bezel, the hairlines, it, it scratches easily, it scratches quick. And if you're OCD, it'll drive you nuts. Where do you see the other precious metals that are, that don't have the ceramic going? You know what I mean? If you picture it in your head, adding the ceramic bezel to a solid gold piece, there is a contrast there that takes away from a solid gold piece, if that makes sense. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So there's some people out there that they want an, they want a yellow gold Daytona because they, they want it all yellow gold. They want a rose gold Daytona because they want all rose gold. Yeah. So there's there's plenty of people out there that we'll won't want to buy that because they have they probably already have I mean, a, here's, a ceramic bezel Daytona. Here's where the contrast makes sense. Right. That looks see that looks really That's, good. It'll look good with that on a bracelet. 
but there's some people that won't want that because they want they'll still want the gold solid bezel. gold yeah and then you know if i had if i had a white daytona a ceramic and then i had you know like my ye a yellow gold daytona i wouldn't want both of them to have a black ceramic bezel because i want something a little bit different you know? yeah so there, there, there will still be an equal market for them if and when they do that. Makes sense. Dude, y'all got to try this new format out. I just posted that two minutes ago, and it just sold. Yeah. I mean, the price was too cheap. That was too cheap. <laughs> <laughs> Hence, it was not the format. It was the price. <laughs> yeah, the but, but it's a really cool format when you do that. Because you, because here's what I started yeah, doing. Yeah. But you put that question box in there, so people that are actually interested. Can uh, okay. you get, can reply straight to you? Yeah. What is that? Versus having to filter through the hundreds of messages I get.